is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray, and with me here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And what we have to look forward to is live coverage from the Segunda División. This really should be a belter of a game, Stuart. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? I'm delighted to be able to say perfect playing conditions for this game here at the Estadio Jose Soria. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined as always by Stuart Robson. And what we have to look forward to is live coverage from the Segunda División. And Stuart, so many storylines. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. This is the kind of occasion we all relish as football fans. Non-stop hype all week long, and now for the action. Welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And what we're getting ready to bring you is live action from the Segunda División. Stuart, this ought to be a terrific spectacle. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward, and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. Let's hope we see that today. Right, Derek. While the 
result was poor, the display was even worse. They never got to grips with the opposition. They were second best in every facet of the game. They need to do a lot of improvement. What more could you ask for? Perfect playing conditions for all concerned here at the Municipal de Iporua Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, getting ready to bring you all the action, accompanied by my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And what we're getting ready to bring you is live action from the Segunda División. Two wingers. The system has a nice balance to it. More. The tempo of their passing was too slow, they were second to the ball too many times and were beaten by the better side today. Well, he often cuts the figure of a thinking person's footballer, but Stewart, he's thought his way throughout this match. Yeah, not much more you could ask for, really. Plenty of effort, a goal, and most importantly, the right result. He should be happy with today. Two wins in the last four games. Uh, I'm pretty happy with it. 2-1 uh, against Leganes. Two goals of Mendes. That was a great start. Uh, but then we had two bad games. Valladolid and Malaga where we didn't score. 0-2 uh, and 0-3. Uh, that wasn't so good for us. But this last game against Eibar. Uh, I thought we were back in action again. Salazar had two goals and McDonald made his first goal. Uh, happy to see that. So, yeah, a little bit up and down, uh, but at least we're winning at half of the game, if you could say that. So, yeah, I think it's a positive way uh, to look at it. Uh, yeah, every win is a big win for us, at least, if you look at our squad. So, yeah, I hope this will continue. Everyone, the weather forecast has promised us a very pleasant day for football and that's exactly what we've got. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray and sitting alongside me the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player Stuart Robson. And what we have for you is live action from the Segunda División. What a match this promises to be Stuart. Thanks Derek. Well both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly. Pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. Uh, our starting 11 have played three of the last four games, so it was time for the reserves to get a game again. And uh, yeah, Mendes have been on fire, and uh, McDonald has made the first goal. So I'm confident against Alcor. Let's hope we see that today. Will go. looking attack and it goes the goal for one nil and that changes the dynamic and cuts 
opposition side. And he could be in proper trouble here. Well, how close was that? Inches away. A go here. Oh, and it goes! Sensational strike! And now he deserves to celebrate! Chance to do damage. It looks promising. Cutting the ball back. is just as good. That's an excellent goal. On to Bustos. Well, the fans are driving their team on here, but can they respond with a goal? Time is running out. And players waiting at the far post. Oh, denied him brilliantly. Well, that would have wrapped it up, wouldn't it? What a brilliant save that is. So the referee blows for full time and it goes down as a victory for the visitors. Well, we touched on it before the game. They've struggled to score goals, but today they were far more threatening. And a lot of that came from the midfield players who passed around the pressure really well. That's a good win for them. Yeah, it was a little setback this game, Alcorcon was a little better in the first half and I thought we made a better second half, uh, especially with the Mendes goal, uh, I thought we were pushing for another goal, but it wasn't meant to be, uh, so no points from this game, but um, I think it deserves made a good game, if you have to remember, these are the reserves for John very young uh, starting 11 so uh, they're really trying the best so uh, well I'm looking forward uh, at least against a rival game here at Girona uh, as our next opponent that will be fun This is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. We'll have every kick of the ball for you live on EA TV. Night in store for all concerned. Good evening and welcome. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and alongside me is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson and we have live Segunda Division action coming right up for you. Stuart, this ought to be a fantastic watch. Thanks Derek as always, this should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium, we've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? So, our 
Starting 11 is back against Girona. Uh, derby game. So, yeah, we are really playing our best player. And uh, I hope uh, Salazar keep on scoring. Break forward really quickly. Let's hope they play it well today. Bustos moving into the advanced position and crossing towards the far post and he's headed it in well here's the replay and it's a really inviting ball played into the box begging players to attack it and it's such a well executed header back over the keeper into the opposite corner excellent goal decisive here trailing as they are they're not likely to get too many opportunities late in this game this could be the equalizer and it is the equalizer late drama here and no wonder they're celebrating remarkable well as you can see he makes it look easy in the end but i think that's a good finish he'll be pleased with that Derek, it was a really good game between two evenly matched teams. Both had their moments, but neither side really deserved to lose this one. really feel it was a derby game out there today uh, was a good football game too uh, both Girona and uh, our team made a good game um, 
nice goals and a free kick at the end. If that had been a goal, that would be a perfect ending of this game for us at least. But yeah, I like it. Uh, we had two wins, one draw uh, in the last six games. So it's getting better and better. I actually think that. We're coming so far in this season, so the players have really moved together, especially the starting eleven. So I'm excited to see you know, what this team can do at the last games of this season. Yeah.